Normally you cook rice like one to one, one and a half to one, but this is like double the liquid because I want it really nice and creamy. So a lot of milk, it's like four cups of milk. I wouldn't use water, the milk makes it really nice and creamy. And then there's only one rice in my mind to make rice pudding and that's basmati. It just smells so fragrant. And now let's start spicing it out. Ground cardamom. This stuff is crazy. There's so much going on in there. And cardamom's best friend is cinnamon. They're the Burton Ernie of spices. Everybody knows it. They're quite cute and loves to watch them. All right, <laughs> and for some more life, some ground ginger. I like doing this all with dry spices. It keeps the rice really nice and silky. And then for some more flavor, because it's a dessert, vanilla. Already, it smells like chai tea. It's the cardamom in the milk. It hits you right in the face. Delicious. But you want it nice and sweet, so some brown sugar. You could use white sugar, but brown sugar is just so fun. There's molasses in it. It's got caramel notes, and when it melts, it almost gets like this silky caramel consistency to it. That's perfect. The rice pudding. The texture of it is so good, and the smell of it is like chai tea, and it's super creamy, super floral, and it's really nice and sweet. You could even do this and pop them into the fridge and cool it down a little bit. Because there's so much liquid in it, you could serve it cold, but I like serving it a little bit warm, even hot. It's just the way to do it. And when you eat it warm, so much of those spices are alive and awake. It's perfect. That's delicious. So just to finish it, I like a little bit more cinnamon. Yeah, just touch it, just touch it, just touch it, touch it, touch it. That's it and the crunchy nuts. So the rice is really creamy, it's really floral, and you got some fresh cinnamon on there and crunchy nuts. That is delicious. It's smooth, it's creamy, it's warm, it's spiced out, it's easy, it's cheap, and you're having it for dinner. Whoa bam